I am Balram Bhargav and I am basically a cardiologist uh, working at the All India Institute for over the last 30 years, having treated about a quarter million patients during this 30 years of my journey at All India Institute. Over the last three and a half years, I am serving the Indian Council of Medical Research and as uh, it was an absolute paradigm shift for me from being a physician looking after a single patient to a public health specialist to be looking after several programs uh, which are helping the nation in the health of the citizens of the country. This COVID pandemic has totally consumed not only the entire ICMR scientists but also the entire resources within the country for taking care of the health of the citizens. Today we will be talking about how we have conceived the use of unmanned aerial vehicles or what we commonly call as drones for the delivery of vaccines in the remotest parts of India and how this project was conceived and how we are trying to uh, do this in remote areas of Nagaland and Mizoram uh, in, in the very near future. The Indian Council of Medical Research is more than a century old research body involved on various communicable and non-communicable diseases over the last hundred years contributing to the health of the nation and of its citizens and guiding the program or the ministry to deliver the best possible for the citizens of this country. Over the last one and a half years we have been fighting with the COVID pandemic in every which way. We isolated uh, the virus, or we developed the vaccine, we scaled up the testing facilities for the entire country so that RT-PCR tests, rapid antigen tests, molecular tests and home testing could be scaled up for to be available for every citizen of the country. Today we have more than 600 million tests which have been done and a repository available with us in ICMR and the Ministry of Health. Unmanned aerial vehicles or drones as we called are emerging as one of the interesting modalities not only for delivering vaccines but for medicines for supplies in remotest parts of the country. India is a large large country 4,000 kilometers north to south 4,000 kilometers east to west and several islands that we have, whether it be Andaman Nicobar or Lakshadweep uh, Islands. And we have very difficult terrains in India because of the Himalayan mountain range and therefore delivering vaccines through the unmanned aerial uh, vehicle route is going to be a game changer in delivering vaccines in areas which are very remote and hard to reach, which can be reached uh, with these vehicles within a few minutes. There is a lot of a population who have a problem of vaccine hesitancy and however, because of the communication in India, a large proportion of our population is very eager to get the vaccines and we should remember these vaccines are absolutely safe and since they are disease modifying vaccines, they do prevent severe disease, they do prevent hospitalization and they do prevent death and therefore use of these vaccines is vitally important in our battle against this pandemic and uh, we will have to really scale up our vaccination program which has shown such excellence over the last few months that I'm sure that we will be the, the country which has been leading the vaccination in the entire world in terms of the numbers, in terms of the scale and in terms of the speed of vaccination. <music>